first YouTube video and today I'm going to show you guys how to set up a D-Link router. This took me forever to do. It freaking is horrible. I literally took days to do this. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go down here and you're going to type in CMD. Alright, go up here and click on the program. Next thing you're to write in is IP config or config. So IP C O N F I G. Alright, you're gonna come up with this list. Now you you should have well I have Hammond actually, so I'll have an extra one. But if you're connected to a wired connection it'll be say like wireless LAN adapter and wire rent wired LAN adapter. Right now I'm on a wireless. What you're going to want to grab is this default gateway. If you can read this from here. Default gateway right there. You're going to want to grab the code from there. You can hit control or control C. That usually copies it. Sometimes it doesn't. Uh, oh, it didn't even copy it. Hold, Hold on. Alright, so I'm back. Anyways, so you write in the code, you got the code right here. You want to minimize this, no, don't close it, don't close it. Alright, so I'm at my corporation. Um, for routers like this, usually the password is admin admin. I've changed the password, so just want to let you guys know. Or you can go on the internet, look up what it is. In case you forgot your password, you'll have to reset your router. I'm not going to show you how this video is only based on one thing so I'll let you guys know alright so you're gonna go to advanced don't don't even do anything with this virtual server it's pointless I tried it multiple times it doesn't do jack all port forwarding alright so for different routers it's pretty much the same see I have my Terraria this is my IP address for Wi-Fi this is my IP address for wired Minecraft. The only difference is the uh, port. For the port, so this is the f the start finish start finish. You want to allow inbound filter allow all. So for any game, you can write in whatever name you want, like blah 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 blah. Your IP address is one of these. See, I've got two. That's my wired wireless. And I like to play on a wired connection because it's got better quality connections. So then you hit save settings. I've got nothing to save. Nothing has changed. Save anyways. Actually, wait. I'm on a wireless right now, so I'm going to change these up both to uh, wired. Wireless, sorry. And in case... Oh, what I didn't figure out here was that Hamachi was actually, or Hamachi was actually screwing up what I was doing. So just continue watching. Oh. What's the conflict? Let's check this out. Alright, well, I had some difficulties, but they seem to have work, worked a bit. So, basically, to figure out your server IP, you have to go, what? It's right here, actually. What? What is my IP.com? See, that's my IP address. That's my external one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take my external. I'm gonna go, hey buddies, friends, or whatever. Come check this out. Oh, now I know why it's not working. My goddamn Hamachi, Hamachi's on. Hamachi is basically useless. You have to disable and everything if you decide to port forward because it screws everything over, like royally screws. You want to know if you guys want to know how to do that, just quickly go open media sharing, go to change adapter settings. Yeah, look at this little bastard. It's turned on. It turned itself on. I think I might just delete it or figure out a way to delete it. I'm going to see I disabled it. Now watch what happens. I put terrarian computer wired wireless 
IP address, as I can see by this, that's my wireless. Bam, bam. Just put 777. Oh, that's there. Then click it in, save settings. Wow, it worked. Because Hamachi screws everything up. So don't download Hamachi if you plan on port forwarding it. Because you can't have both running at once, or else your computer goes. So, I'm just going to open up, open up Terraria really, real quick. I'm just going to skip through this. Alright, we're back. Anyways, so, I just go to my multiplayer settings. Actually, make this into a window, or if I can click anything. For some reason, I can't click anything. To be completely honest with you guys, everything that could go wrong has gone wrong. Let me just fix this once more. Alright. Ah! I can't click anything! I'll be right back, guys. Alright. So, sorry about that. That was a little bit of a mishap. I finally got it working. And, um... I... Oh, I can't click buttons again? Seriously? You can't be freaking kidding me. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Alright. So you're gonna go go to here. Yeah, go to multiplayer, and then you're gonna go to. Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot to mention something. Before you, you have to have the server software, right? So you're gonna go Terraria.com, whatever Terraria.org. I'm sorry. Okay, go down. Dedicated server software you guys can see that in the bottom. Alright, so then you go back. I have it conveniently. Holy crap. Alright, I kind of lost my train of what I was doing because I had to go do something. Alright. So I conveniently put my Terraria server in this. There it is. Start it up. Sweden. Two players. Server port 777. See that? Yeah. Oh, crap. Alright, so for password, I guess I'll put nothing in. Setting up objects. Setting them up, setting them up, setting them up, setting them up. Setting them up. Alright, let's skip this. Okay. So, I got this. Got Terraria that I can't use just yet because I'm using this video thing. You want to go to join? All right. So I got all these server IP addresses to choose from. So what it, I'm not sure how this ended up working out, but this is the server IP. You can't write in your external IP address in this. It doesn't seem to work, or it might work for you guys. It doesn't work for me, so I select this one, and then it loads it. All right. As you can see, retrieving data, retrieving data complete. I got all this stuff over here. Current player is Lucas. See, Lucas has joined. My name's not Lucas, my name's Liam. I'll let you know. Alright, remember the three main things. Port forward, get your IP address from CMD. Look for the put in IP config. IP config. And then put in this default gateway. This is your I'm pretty sure you can use this to get on your server also. I just use the other password kind of thing. And then remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I will be putting all the links in the description. Also, one last thing I wanted to add is I might be starting a Let's Play series with Terraria or Minecraft and or Minecraft. Um, thanks for watching this video. Alright, peace out.